going on, everybody? I hope everyone's having a fantastic evening, afternoon, and great noon. No matter where you are in the world, the Wasson Piker and this is the Austin awesome Broadcast coming to you live from sunny California, Los Angeles, folks. We're live and alive, and I hope all the boys, girls, and MBs are having a fantastic one because today's a beautiful day. It's, uh, it's, it. I want to, I want to dance around and I want to do the classic like Friday thing and be like, it's Friday, you know what I mean? Saturday, Sunday. But uh, I don't want to do that because. Not a very good Friday, I'll be honest with you. I even felt weird about uh, playing the intro music as I normally do. Because right now, uh, uh, as as we are speaking, as we are talking, Kitchy88, thank you for the 25, get the subs. Um, uh, the, the IDF uh, has cut off all comms on the ground in Gaza and is most likely moving its uh, its its ground troops into Gaza as well. Um, I am going to try my very best to get you live updates from the ground. I mean, we have very little information. This is the only thing we have. Here's the Gaza City skyline. <laughs> that buzzing that you're hearing is, uh, drones that are constantly above the, uh, above the, the, uh, city. Thank you, Tamarius. So... I feel weird. I feel I feel odd, and and it's it's hard to start to do my normal song and dance on Friday because the Immaculate Friday vibes are fucked right now. I'll be honest with you. Um, uh, but as far as personal news goes, I was supposed to go to a birthday party slash Halloween party last night, but instead, because I'm feeling sick, I chose to stay behind and uh, stay at home and watch Gen V instead. And also, uh, this morning I worked out, and while I was doing my T's and Y's that uh, I normally do with chest supported, with chest support on a bench press, uh, I did it without, and I feel like my legs were so shot over the course of this past week that I might have tweaked my lower back a little bit. Not like terribly, but I'm in a little bit of pain. CNN is on the ground from Israel's side. We can get some uh, information on that front right now. I, I but think that just reinforces what the IDF have been warning the citizens here to be careful about, to stay close to their shelters. And it's indicative but of we'll the get fact started that the right away. tempo 